Now in this video, we will be talking about the, some basic and the important concept that is the local variable and the global variable. Okay, so actually we have already covered the functions, so that is very important to know about the concept of local variable and the global variable. So let me create the file with the name lvar and the gvar. .sh, okay, and I'll just add the shebang here, bin bash. Okay, now we are good to go. So I will start with the basic definition of the local variable. So if you like, uh, I will just write local variable. So we can define the local variable as the uh, variable which is, uh, which is, sorry, uh, which is declared inside a function is called as local variable. Okay, sorry for mistakes. Okay, my typing is not good so much. That's why it is happening. So, so what is the local variable? So, local variable we can define it as like the variable which is declared inside a function. That is the local variable. Okay, so, so suppose if I am creating one uh, variable that is the function one. Okay, name of the function is function one, and I am defining a variable that is a equal to twenty. Uh, sorry 10 so in this case what is this so a is nothing but a local variable okay so if i will do echo a here uh, echo dollar a and i will just call this function function one and let me just add certain permission to this file that is the 21 clear dot slash 21 Okay, so now I will just run the script uh, 21 underscore. Okay, so it's not. Uh, okay, let me just again. Yeah, clear the screen dot slash 21 now. Okay, so here you can see we are getting the value as a uh, value of a as a 10. Okay, so this is the local variable. Like uh, we have declared this variable inside a function so that uh, we can access this inside this function only, not outside of this function. So if you want to print uh, like uh, uh, without function calling, okay, I will just print here equal dollar a. So let me let's uh, see what happens. So it will. I don't think it will print anything. Clear the screen again. So here you can see we are not getting any kind of result here. Okay. So this is happening because we can't access the uh, local variable outside of the function. So that is the thing we can uh, get to know with this thing. Okay. So I will just comment out this and I will just uh, again. Uh, call this function and now I will discuss about with the what is the global variable. Okay. So global, let me just uh, write like this global variable. Okay, so this is the variable which is uh, which is declared outside the function. Okay, jo bhi, uh, like whatever the variable which is declared outside the function that is called as the global variable. Okay, I hope you got the idea. Okay. So let me just comment out these things and I will create the variable name as the gvar. Okay, gvar equal to 20. Okay, or I can just uh, define the string like I am a global variable. Okay, so this variable can be accessed from anywhere of your program like inside the function or outside the function. So if I will just call here echo dollar gvar okay so here we can see the result as the i am the global variable okay so here we can we are getting the result i'm a global variable but now if you want to uh, again echo the same thing inside the function also so we can also get the result two times like i'm a global variable so here you can see 10 and then i'm a global variable so you <laughs> you should see the uh, like how the function is executing like when when first what is happening we are just printing this global variable and when we and then we have called the function so after calling the function we are getting the first it is calling this uh, local variable and then it is calling this one gvar that is the global variable okay so this is the simple concept of the uh, local variable and the global variable uh, i have discussed why because we have already covered the functions and th this thing you should know about it okay so that's all for today's guys and i hope you liked it and if you have any queries you can ask in the comment section and i will post all these things in our github repository okay so thank you for watching and i'll meet you in the next video thank you